breakfast. Five bananas and a parcel of watermelon. They're all right. Not great. Mm, very good. Looks like there's something in the lens just behind the front glass. Mm. Compost bin. Just about to head out for my run. I have nine dates here that I'm taking with me, and I ate 12 of them. I'll probably do pretty much the same run I did yesterday. Slightly slower up today than yesterday, and slightly faster than the two previous days. But I felt better going up today than I did the first time yesterday. Had some water, two dates, and I head back down very shortly. Second time today. Whew. Went a little faster. Fastest time this week. 35 minutes about. Um, my PR up here is 28 minutes and change. I think I can go faster, but it's going to be a little while until I decide to 
make another hard effort out here. Whew. Had a little water, gonna have some dates, and then I'm gonna run back down. for my run it was pretty good it was, it was great um felt better than yesterday and yeah it was fun I, I set a goal at the beginning of the, of the year to hit hit the upper falls 50 times this year today was number 49 and 50 now what I guess we'll just keep doing it. Rice is cooking. I have melon. While that cooks, right up my training log. Two cups dry brown rice, four tablespoons flaxseed, about a pound or so of sweet potatoes, uh, some asparagus, and sweet chili sauce. Video is uploading. I wanted to talk about something I was thinking about on my run and I've thought about in the past as well. You do what's right because it's right, not because of consequences or uh, punishment. I was out on the trail and I saw litter and I thought for a second about going past it and just leaving it. And I actually did go a few steps past when I stopped and bent down and picked it up. And, and then there were there were some small branches on across the trail, and uh, there were other people coming in one spot. There was a branch, other people coming up and down. Uh, I was on my way up. I had just passed a couple people, and there were some other people on their way down up ahead. I was going uphill, didn't really have to lean down very far, lean down, grab the branch, toss it off to the side. I'm sure those people saw me and they, I don't know whether they paid attention or not or what they thought about it, it didn't really matter to me because, well, for one, I didn't want to run into it on the way back down. And uh, also, it, I don't know, it was the right thing to do, or th I thought it was the right thing to do at the time. And those people wouldn't, probably wouldn't have thought anything had I not reached down and picked the branch up and moved it off the trail. They probably wouldn't even noticed. Um, but that's not the point. And the more you do this, especially when no one is watching, it becomes a habit. And when it comes to a time when it does matter, whether there are consequences or punishments or uh, someone's opinion of you will matter in the moment, uh, whether it's a uh, friend, uh, your boss, coworker, whatever. If, if you're not doing the right thing when you're alone and no one's watching, it's gonna be more difficult to do it when people are watching. It's just practice, it has to become habit like anything. Um, like changing your diet or uh, ex exercising, it has to become a habit in order to make it easier so that you'll follow through and continue to do it. And I, I, I'm not perfect. I still, like with litter, I, there's still times where I see stuff and I don't pick it up. Um, Usually it's really gross stuff, like bags of dog poop, 
or use toilet paper, but sometimes I, I just won't pick stuff up. I try to pick up at least one thing when I'm out, but sometimes I just I forget or it's uh, it seems like too much of a burden at the time, too much of a hassle, which it never really is. Or I think, uh, I'll remember where it is and I'll pick up it, pick it up on the way back out. But then inevitably I forget until I remember well past where it was. Um, so it's, it's a work in progress, like everything in life. Uh, you just have to practice and until, until it becomes a habit. That's just one example. Uh, it may be a fairly innocuous and maybe even meaningless to some, but I think it it illustrates the point. Um, I'm going to read for a few minutes and go to sleep. Thank you for watching. Have an awesome day. Thank you.